Here we go, back at it yet again with another video. Good day, guys, I'm Champ Chong, and if you guys love video games like I do, make sure you smack that like button real, real good. But just before we do get to our first bit of gaming news, I wanted to let you guys know that I was sent this. It's the Aten Phantom S. I'll be showing it off and how it works and everything later in the video, so make sure you stay tuned for that because this device is great for console gamers. But for now, we've got some gaming news to get to, so let's get right into it. But now moving on to this, and it's the Aten Phantom S. It is a gamepad to keyboard emulator, and it's perfect for gamers on PlayStation and Xbox. So I'm going to show you guys how it works, and if you want to pick one up for yourself, check out the link in the description down below. The Aten Phantom S is compatible with the PlayStation 3, PlayStation 4, Xbox 360, and Xbox One. The device is perfect especially for gamers on console who play a lot of FPS games and would rather use a keyboard keyboard and mouse than a controller and I see it as a great transition for those gamers who are trying to sharpen their skills going from controller to mouse and keyboard. So basically all you have to do is plug your keyboard, mouse and gamepad into the Phantom S and then it emulates your controller into the mouse and keyboard. It's really awesome but let me actually show you guys how this works. Alrighty so here is everything set up. I've got my Xbox turned on, the Xbox is back there. I've got the A10 Phantom S right here and then I've got my Xbox controller and then I've got my mouse and let's bring this right over here which is the keyboard so I'm gonna put this right here as you can tell my mouse and keyboard aren't on because I actually haven't set it all up I haven't plugged anything in just yet all I've done is that I've plugged in my uh, these power cables right here essentially so these make this system work so basically I've got to put one in the power and as soon as I do that there it is it turns on you can see that blue light now I'll do this, and this is for the game, so there's that. So that's simple, that's going directly into my Xbox. It's really, really simple. Then, on top of that, here is my gamepad, my controller. This right here, the USB for that. I will put where it says gamepad, I'm not 100% sure if you guys can read that, but there it is, it goes in, and there we go. The controller can turn on now. I'm not gonna turn it on just yet. What I am going to do is plug in my keyboard. So my keyboard goes right here. Bam, there we go, it's in. And you probably think I'm faking this because I'm actually managing to get the USBs in first go. So this is the mouse, and there we go. So now the mouse is on, you can see the keyboard lights up. Everything is sweet. I'm gonna turn on the controller, and I'm gonna load up a game for you guys. So now that we're all set up, I've got it plugged into my computer to bring the Aten software up. What's really awesome is that you can use this software to have custom button mapping and even set up profiles for different games so you don't have to change it all the time. And honestly, this does save a whole lot of time. And this is especially handy if you're changing consoles with the device. Anyway, let me show you guys what it's actually like to play games with the Phantom S. So here we are with the actual setup. As you can see, I've got Red Dead Redemption up here now the reason I chose Red Dead Redemption instead of like a first-person shooter game which is probably what you really want to use this for but the reason I got Red Dead is the fact that it's not actually on PC and I thought why not have a keyboard and mouse set up for a game like this so look at this just watch look at that it works if I press W he moves forwards how awesome is that so it actually works everything is good I can even aim just as I normally would bang bang it's it's just it's awesome I love this now let me show you guys around so I've got my keyboard here got my mouse got the Phantom S over there just just right here and I've got my controller just here so let me actually just move this out of here I put the controller there so you guys can see that I'm not using it now I will do this See, you can still move it. I am moving, look, see in the game, I'm moving and moving and moving and stuff. And in in Red Dead, uh, you press A, you tap A or hold it to kind of go quicker. But here you're going to use the space bar. And as you can see, he does a jump there, he does a jump. And then the cool thing is, um, I'm actually not sure of all the keybinds just yet. I've just started to learn this game with the mouse and keyboard. It's very, very different because, well, obviously it's only ever been um, on, on the uh, on the consoles and not on PC. But here I press E, it looks behind me. Um, over here I press the Q key and then I can choose what I want from my weapons. So there I can choose this right here. 
and it's really awesome. And here, someone's just uh, wanted to talk to me, but I don't, I don't want to talk to them because I want to just shoot guns and stuff like bang, bang, and all this. So I don't actually have sound right now. I didn't set it up for this video, but you can see it's really, really awesome. Everything works as it would. Here we go. So there we are. So that's first person. You can go like that and then it's reloading the gun. How, how freaking awesome is that? So that is Red Dead Redemption 2 in first person with the Phantom S, the A10 Phantom S. So yeah, it's, it's really awesome right there. And I, I love the fact that you can do this. So yeah, that's the Eight and Phantom S. If you want to pick one up for yourself, make sure you check out the link in the description. It's an awesome device for those gamers wanting to use a mouse and keyboard on console. A big thanks to Aiton for sponsoring this video and sending me a Phantom S to show you guys. And uh, yeah, now let's get back into the regular scheduled programming of gaming news.